Hey everyone, so today I'm making the paper babies in a tutorial to show what you peoples. And I'm really sorry if this is like, I'm like having to make a homemade little tripod thing. So, I'm really sorry if it's like out of focus or not the right height. But yeah, these are really big going around. Sorry, I was reading a message that I got, but anyway. So, um, I'm going to be showing you how to make a paper baby. Like I said, these are going around in my school a lot. I'm not really sure why. I just got bored one day in class and made a paper baby. I would show you my paper baby, Elliot, but he's in my book bag right now because my parents don't really know that I'm making these. <laughs> Which, it's fine because, like... I don't know, I just thought it would be really weird if I was like, Hey mom, I'm making a paper baby. Yeah, mm -hmm. I have one named Elliot. Yeah, it just I just thought it would be a bit weird, but yeah. Um, so, I made my friend Alexis one, and then my friend Holly wanted one, then my friend um, Mary wanted one, my friend Brielle, my friend Isla, my friend Skyler, they all want one, so gotta make them. So, this would be one of them, and they want... Four of them want a girl, and then one of them want a boy. So, you're going to start out with one piece of paper. You're going to need a lot of paper, though, like a ton of paper. To start out with one piece of paper, you're going to need some scissors. These are just Fiskars ones. They look like this. I'm covering up my name because it's on it. They're Fiskars, and they're just really cool. And they're blue, and yeah, they're just rock in the style. And then you're going to need a pencil. The, this is just a mechanical pencil. It doesn't really matter. If you want, like, to not be able to, like, erase, like, your eyes or your nose or whatever, then here is a Sharpie fine point you can use. Yeah. So first is the head. Oh, and you're going to need a glue stick. Speaking of what, switch. Do I even have a glue stick right now? Crappy do. Hold on. Because I think there's one over here. Okay, I found one. Okay, you're going to need a glue stick. This one is just Elmer's washable school glue. So you're going to need a glue stick. And, sorry, I saw little Anthony do that. So I just did it. Um, anyway, take your piece of notebook paper. I'm using lined paper. If you don't want lines all over your baby, then use, um, what's it called? Copy paper. So you're just going to take your scissors and then you're going to cut out a circular head shape in here on your piece of paper. So, like that. This. And then you're going to take other like part of it and then you're gonna like put it right here and then you're just gonna like cut you know what I'm saying like put it up to here and then you're gonna cut that shape out one more time if you do what I'm saying if you don't then just skip until I'm done cutting because I'm gonna cut myself just joking I'm not really gonna eat that um but yeah And if you want to, like, kind of cut over what you just did, like, to curve out the lines, you can totally do that, um, of, like, the head that you just cut out. Because I know sometimes when I'm cutting these heads that, it sounded really long, but when I'm cutting these heads, they, like, get edges in them, and it looks really weird. So if you want to make them more circular, you can, and there's, like, a big point of So, yeah, you just, you're going to have two things, like, circular things that match up with each other, like, they're the same size. And then you're going to have a little piece of paper that looks like this. And you don't want to keep this, by the way, unless you just, like, recycle paper and you want to keep it. But, yeah, I don't, so, yeah. Um, so once you have the heads, this is probably going to be the first part to this video, because, yeah, my phone can only take, like, 11 minutes, I think. And it might be a little bit more than 11 minutes. 
and I don't have a lot of storage on my phone. So, let's see if you can see this. You're just gonna like wanna put glue on here. So, if you can see what I'm doing. I'm really sorry guys, I'm trying to see. So you're just gonna put glue all over this one part of the head. And it should look like somewhat like this. And you want to take the other part of the head and just stick them on here. I have to like line it up good because I'm very like weird about that. Oh my gosh. Okay. And yeah, like I said, if you don't want to use lined paper, that is totes fine. Because I know a lot of people don't like to use lined paper. And hey, that's okay. I'm sorry, but I think I didn't like. So I just went ahead and stuck this on here. And if you see like little edges hanging out that you don't like, you can just take your scissors again and cut those off. Hope you guys can see this. So you want them to like line up really good. You can just chop those off. Almost done. Sorry, I don't have like fast forwarding on here, so I would fast forward it, but I don't have that. So yeah, so now I have the head complete, and you can see all the little, like, shavings that I did right there. So I put it on a front camera, like, on my phone, and so it's like, I can't flip the, I can't switch the camera around, and sorry about that really bright light. It's like storming at my house, so I have to use artificial light. And if you want an O O O T D, I think it's called. I'm wearing this black scarf, a white shirt from um, Abercrombie, a black tank top, and then I'm just wearing capri pants from American Eagle, but I don't think that's interesting, so yeah. Oh, and then my bell is really cute. It's like chevron. Sorry, I'm kind of obsessed. Like, I'm going through a phase of chevron, and there's something on my phone. Oh my gosh, I don't know what that is. Holy crap. But yeah, it's really weird, but... Yeah, so anyway... Whoa, I don't know why it's there. Anyway, I'm, like, wasting time. So, <clears throat> yeah, that's how to make the head. And I'm gonna make a part two. Yeah, I'm gonna make a part two because this video is getting really, really long and I don't want to, like... You know make it too long and I'm sorry if I'm like looking into the screen I should be looking over there to the camera but yeah gotta get used to that because I'm just so conceited and I want to see myself all the time JK but anyway yeah I hope you guys know this video and just stay tuned for the other one there may be a part three I know that's gonna be part two there may be a part three to show you the arms and then the legs and then how to glue them all together so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye, guys.